Okay, are we ready for our next story? The next story is Oi Frog and it's written by Kez Gray and Jim Field. Oi Frog, said the cat. Sit on a log. But I don't want to sit on a log, said the frog. Logs are all knobbly and uncomfortable. And you get a splinter in your bottom. I don't care, said the cat. You are a frog and you must sit on a log. Can I sit on a mat? asked the frog. Only cats sit on mats, said the cat. What about a chair? said the frog. I wouldn't mind sitting on a chair. Chairs off our hairs, said the cat. Perhaps I could sit on a stool, asked the frog. Mules sit on stools, said the cat. What about a sofa? asked the frog. I could stretch right out on a sofa. Gophers are for sofas, said the cat. It's very simple, really. Cats sit on mats. Hares sit on chairs. Mules sit on stools. Gophers sit on sofas. And frogs sit on logs. Oh, well, what do lions sit on? asked the frog. Lions sit on irons, said the cat. Ouch, said the frog. And what about parrots? Parrots sit on carrots. Lions sit on irons. And parrots sit on carrots. doesn't sound very comfortable, said the frog. It's not about being comfortable, said the cat. It's about doing the right thing. What do foxes sit on? asked the frog. Foxes sit on boxes, said the cat. Foxes sit on boxes and fleas sit on peas. What do goats sit on? asked the frog. Goats sit on coats, said the cat. Goats sit on coats, cows sit on ploughs, and storks sit on forks. Well, what do gorillas sit on? asked the frog. Gorillas sit on pillars, said the cat. Gorillas sit on pillars. Rats sit on hats. Weasels sit on easels. And moles sit on poles. Well, what do seals sit on? asked the frog. Don't you know anything? said the cat. Seals sit on wheels. Doves sit on gloves. Newts sit on flutes. Lizards sit on wizards. And apes sit on grapes. What about puffins? asked the frog. Puffins sit on muffins, said the cat. <sighs> Puffins sit on muffins. Snakes sit on cakes. Owls sit on towels. Gibbons sit on ribbons. Lambs sit on jams. Bees sit on keys. And pumas sit on satsumas. Well, sure I never knew that, said the frog. Well, you do now said the cat. And what do dogs sit on? said the frog. Mm, I was rather hoping you wouldn't ask that. <coughs> so, as it turns out, dogs sit on frogs. I hope you enjoyed today's story tell. And I hope you remember to tune in to Book Trust NA throughout the day and throughout the rest of the week. There'll be lots of things available on there. Activities and storybooks, meeting the author, meeting illustrators. So you'll have lots of things to keep you going. 
I hope you enjoyed today. Goodbye.